guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Emily Lucy Ratch. If you're new here, I've got an Instagram account, a TikTok account, and a YouTube channel. So welcome if this is your first time. Please make sure you give this video a big thumbs up and make sure you subscribe before we get going. Today's video is a sponsored one and it is sponsored by Boohoo, one of my fave all-time brands. And this is all my autumn favourites that are currently on Boohoo's new in page. So let's get going. I just want to make things right Oh my god, I've got three huge bags to share with you And I think I know why they're so big Because I ordered a lot of puffer things And I've just taken a lot of space up So I haven't even opened this yet I haven't opened any of them So let's have a look what's inside So the first thing I want to show you guys I picked up is a checked shirt So let me get out of the packet I chose this one in two shades. This one I've got in a size 14, and I think this one is in a size 12, so I've got two different sizes to try and compare for you, because I just didn't want it to be too shapeless and oversized. So I thought if I got it in a 12 and a 14, we could really compare and see which is the best size for mid-size bodies. But the quality of both of them looks really good, really thick, and I think they'll be so perfect for layering. You can put a bodysuit underneath it, leather leggings, this check shirt over the top, you can even wear it with jeans, a top underneath. They're just so good for layering, jumpers, roll necks, you name it. You can really build a lot of outfits around these very similar to a shacket. So I've also picked up a shacket as well. So I thought all three of these would be a really good try on to see which we prefer. This one I got in a 14 and it comes with a belt. So it's a belted shacket, which I do find from last year is so flattering on my body shape because it really works to bring me in. Whereas I feel like sometimes they're just oversized shackets because I'm quite short as well and I've got chunkier thighs. I just end up looking a little bit drowned. The same way if I wore like an oversized denim jacket, it just looks a bit like shapeless and like I'm just a big brick. So having the little belt to pull you in at the waist, I found last year worked really, really well. So I saw this on site and I thought, oh, that's so nice because it's just really plain, but it's got the belt. So I think this one is gonna be a real keeper um, to mix and match with outfits. So I'm gonna try all three of those on for you now with the same outfit and then we can decide what we think is the best. This shacket is perfect. I'm so happy with how this shacket fits. I probably could have got away with the 12 because there is quite a lot of fabric here. I think it could do with being just a tiny little bit more fitted, which a 12 would be. So I would size down for this one if I were you guys. And I've just put it with a white t-shirt, leather leggings. You can either do it with the boots. The boots are also from Boohoo and just love this little touch of cream at the bottom. Or you can do it with chunky trainers like I've done here, but I just think this jacket is such a great outfit builder. You could put a bodysuit underneath it, you could put it with jeans, you could put it with a more formal look and wear it with um, and wear it with heeled boots. But you can really dress this up and dress it down, but the key feature is this waist belt. I really do think it is creating such a flattering shape, which other jackets do not do. The fabric is lovely, it's soft, it's really, really flattering. Cannot rave about the jacket anymore. Buy it before it sells out. Like it will go so quickly. I remember last year I read about a belted jacket, never came back in stock. So please, if you are interested in this, do not sit on it, guys. You will miss out, I swear. So the shirt I have just kept with the exact same outfit on and I do again love the colour of this, I really like it. The only thing is I think it is a little bit too big, again I need to size it down. I know this is a style as well, very oversized but personally I feel like the jacket has a lot more of a flattering look. I will keep both, I think this is nice just to throw on, like I'm wearing this with a cropped white t-shirt and leather leggings and it is nice just to have something that is a little bit oversized to wear with something if it's really tight. Like it's just quite nice to have that balance of this being baggy and then whatever you're wearing underneath is tight and you can still feel comfortable and covered if you needed to have a moment to feel like you could, like you are covered. So yeah, I like both. Like I said, I think I would size down. This is just really, really oversized. But so far, love both. Then next, I found some really gorgeous dresses in the autumn section of Boohoo's New Inn. And if you follow me on Instagram, you will know that I absolutely love to do a dress from summer or autumn, tights, and then put a cropped jumper over the top. So I am creating that look again, but just with a little twist. 
This time I have picked this dress up in a size 14. It's got like a quite a low V and it cinches around the waist and then it's got a skater bottom. And I just absolutely love this style to put with tights, boots, and then the jumper over the top. So I'm gonna show you what it looks like just on its own the dress, but then I'm gonna put over the top a little twist and use a roll neck jumper, but cropped. <gasps> I'm excited to try this. This might look absolutely awful, but you gotta try these things and that's why I'm here to be the guinea pig and buy these things and put these outfits together and let's see together if they work or not. So I really like this combination together with the tights and boots and I'm gonna try that on for you right now and let's see what we think. This dress is super cute as well. I'm really happy with the style of this dress and the skater. I feel like it is so perfect to wear with tights, a jacket, boots, and then I'm gonna put the cropped jumper over the top but I think just on itself it's just such a nice dress for autumn you wouldn't think it was summery it's very autumnal with the style of it this little crop is super cute to put over this dress I got this one in a medium and it does work really well because it's got this little slit at the side so it's not too restricting here and it's just like a really nice easy autumn outfit that you can just put on if you wanted to wear tights that day boots and just feel very fall then, staying on dresses, I was searching the new in for autumn bits on Boohoo and I came across these dresses and I was like, ooh, I need to give that a go. The only thing I am curious about is the fact that they are knitted and sometimes when there's a lot going on with a knitted dress, it can be a little bit like wearing a bag. So, fingers crossed, that's not the case with this. So, this dress, it comes in this stone colour, but I've also picked it up in this brown colour as well. Brown is huge for this autumn, so you'll probably see me introducing quite a lot of full brown looks into my wardrobe this autumn. And I absolutely love brown, I feel like it's just such a rich, autumnal colour that just instantly gives you those vibes that it's like cosy and warm and chocolatey. So, I am so about brown being in it this season. This one, I picked it up because it's sleeveless, but it has this like tie detail at the side here, which you can use to wrap over and create this like cinched in waist. Whereas usually in autumn, it's all about like jumper dresses and things like that. And if you are like me, who's got like a little bit of a lower tummy bulge or a bloated tummy or IBS or anything like that, then you will find that these jumper dresses just cling to that area and even if you wear tights it just still looks so bad and prominent in that area it makes it look way bigger than it actually is so having this like a little bit to tie across I think will be a really great way to disguise that but as I just said I haven't tried any of these bits on yet so let's try this on and see what we think I've also got to go with that because, as I mentioned, I'm a huge fan of chocolate, I have picked up this coat, which is long line, double breasted, belted wool look coat in chocolate, size 14, and look at that color. I absolutely love how warm and chocolatey that shade is. It's beautiful. So I'm gonna put that with those dresses as a full look and let's see what we think. But so far, I feel like the quality of this coat looks really good. And as I said, I'm obsessed with this chocolate shade. So this dress, very unusual, but I have to say, I like it, I really like it. So here's the different ways that you can tie it. I've tied it in the front way, first of all. Then you can do like the wrap around method, and then you could also wrap it and tie it from the back and or tie it from the front. There's so many ways you can wear this dress. But I actually have to say, it really does work to pull you in, and I've never seen a knitted dress like this. I actually really like the neckline, I feel like it really, really works well here and then it creates this gorgeous shape so I do actually really like it and then when I put the coat on with it I was like oh my god I love this outfit I feel like it looks so much more expensive than it is I feel like it looks really put together I love this look so much I will say the coat is in a 14 I think it's too big I think I need to size down to a 12 so if I were you I would size down in that if you're a 12 to 14 if you like me in the 12 to 14 um and the dress is in a 14 and I'm glad I got it in a 14 because you really need the fabric to be able to obviously pull it in and um, so you need to have the bigger size so that it got a bit more fabric to work with so yeah I'm pleasantly surprised about this one because I thought it was a bit weird um, but I actually love it and I really love this design. I think it's really complimentary for anyone who has a little tum. And then 
no autumn new in haul would be complete without covering coats and puffer coats are everywhere right now they, they were a lot last autumn as well as you guys will know and i do find that they are one of the items that are harder to wear for anyone mid-size or plus size because they do just add a lot of size and mass to your body shape so i find that there is a way to get it right and that is to not go for too many chunky layers you want to go for something that's a little bit thinner the ones i have picked up today are this long line puffer with no sleeve this was quite a big trend at the start of this year, so January, February time, everyone was really into this like gilet with no sleeve style in the long line. Um, and I had two in cream that I used to wear quite a lot, but cream's just not very easy to keep clean when you are going for walks and you're wearing stuff to the pub, it's raining. So I picked it up in black and I think it'll look really cool with a hoodie and just leggings or leather leggings so I'm gonna try that with this set and I got this one in size 14 it's petite it's called petite hoodie jogger set black so you get a hoodie and joggers in this set these are the joggers in a size 14 they are very lightweight as well so I feel like they'll be really good to build outfits with but the reason I got it was for this hoodie because it looks like it's quite a thin hoodie which is what mid-sized girls need if you wanted to not look bulky in a lot of these layered item looks you might have done it yourself where you put like an oversized hoodie on and then you put a coat on on top and your arms are like stuck and you just literally look uncomfortable because your jacket's a little bit too tight because the hoodie's on there it's just not a good fluttering look whereas going for a hoodie that's a little bit thinner like this one is you can see it's not really thick it's not fleece layered it's just really easy to wear um, it's going to be ideal for this autumn winter to use for layering and obviously if you wanted to wear a t-shirt underneath it and the hoodie on top and then the puffer jacket you are still going to be very warm because the weather is not that cold yet but this is a great transitional piece where you can have your arms out with your thin hoodie on and you can either put it with leather leggings, just standard leggings, there's just so many versatile casual ways to wear this look. So I'm going to try these bits on for you now. Ah, oh, Boohoo always delivers on the hoodies. This is so perfect, I knew it would be. It's nice and thin, it's not too bulky, as you can see you've got the puffer on over the top. It's not too thick, it's not making me look bulky in any way. The fabric's nice and light and then I've just put this over the top as you can see here with some just standard black leggings boots and then a bag over just to elongate the body and make it look all a little less bulky because the, the bag is working to narrow the body. I just love this outfit. I feel like this is me all autumn long. I just love these long line puffers. I'm so glad that they're in right now because I feel like they look so stylish and cool and mid-size appropriate. I also forgot to mention I picked up this puffer coat as well which is long line and I really like this again because it's not too thick and it's not too puffery which is going to make us look really bulky and chunky. This is gorgeous and the length of it is so nice. It's definitely going to be ideal for in winter. I wish I was going to New York. This is like the perfect New York in winter weather coat. It's just so lovely. I really really like this. And I like this like little cream piping detail that goes through it and these cuff details. I think it looks way more expensive than it is. I've put it here with leather leggings and you can just see it like is so long. I'm going for layering with this hoodie. I just think Boohoo Autumn always my absolute favorite for this reason. Every single thing I've got, I've tried on, absolutely love. You cannot go wrong. I feel like it just complements mid-sized body so well so i'm so happy this haul is going so well thank you so much for watching this haul i hope you loved it i've got so many hauls and autumn style suggestions coming up on my youtube channel so please i would love it if you would subscribe and give this video a thumbs up comment down below what videos you want to see from me and i will be back every wednesday and sunday for the foreseeable thank you so much guys bye